Okay, we're going to go and learn how to download and install an MIRC script. This should hopefully stop everybody asking me in IRC how to do it. First thing we're going to do is download the script. So I'm going to use the Twitter script here, one of mine for an example. We get the script. Uh, it's important that we remember where we're going to save this script to when it comes and asks us. Let's download to where where you save to really it doesn't matter as long as you remember where it is. Let's go to clean them IRC. It's here. Now that that's complete. There's, there should be no viruses coming up on this, that's the one of mine. <laughs> Let's go and into that folder. Obviously go and set up screen, however they're set up. And we'll extract this to this case to keep it easy. This is the folder of my MIRC installation. So you'll see it's now extracted three new files here. We've got the curl readme curl executable and the twitter mrc file. And that is a script. An mrc file is simply a text file. So that will give us the. This is a clean mrc install. <coughs> There's no, no other scripts loaded or any information actually being put in this at all. It's used for testing and stuff, this is ideal. The MIRC screen pops up, the familiar look, it will give us this options box. I'm not interested in the options at the moment, so I'll cancel that. Um, to load a script, I'm going to hold down the ALT key and press R. It pops up this, this is the MUX script editor window. Make sure it's on the remote tab here. Then go to File, Load. This will open up a, a CRLC folder. Now this is actually the default installation file, it's not the clean one. So what you're going to do is navigate to where you extracted the files from the zip earlier. Which, uh, just let me think where I can go here. Billy, clean MIRC, and the other here. Now it's showing me script, any or MRC files. If you can't see the file, it may be a text file, it may be some other type. Just change this to all files and you'll see everything. We want to load the MRC file here. All, or mostly, all of my scripts are saved with an MRC extension. It's um, quite common throughout Merck. Open that and then you'll see, well suddenly there's text in here. We can go ahead and that, this is just the code and you can scroll through and read the code or whatever. Click OK to that. And that's it, script is loaded. I can now right click here, see I've got a BT Scripts Twitter tweet, and I can start using the script. 